I'm here at the Mighty Buildings facility in Oakland, California, and behind me you can see their printer printing out their proprietary material. The purple light you see is the UV light that's curing the material as it's being printed. This strategy allows them to print horizontally or really any which way because it instantly hardens the material and gives them a huge range of freedom in design. This is actually the first time that I've seen a large scale 3D printer in action. So it's really cool to be here in the factory and see the operation of this enormous 3D printer. You can see they have one axis on the bottom to go forward and back. And then the printer is like a large square and the two columns support the middle beam that goes back and forth kind of on, I guess, the X axis and then the Z axis up and down. The Mighty Buildings Prefab ADU, it's 350 square feet, almost identical to the unit that we saw in LA. So if you come with me around the side, you can see they implemented a ton of glass, which gives it a super modern look. See their milling station? They use these KUKA robots not dissimilar to other 3D printed robots that are based on robotic arms, and they mill down their 3D printed material to get their desired finish. You can see a closer look at one of the KUKA robots here. The beginnings of their next model. This model uses flat modular panels to print out a building that can be built kind of according to a regular floor plan. There's only one coat of paint on the outside to give it a little bit of a glare. And here, they show you exactly how the insulation on the inside of the walls looks. Now, here's a cross section. This is their current wall. Right now, one unit here and one modular unit here, and they're joined together by these beams. Now, in the future, they're going to use a fiber reinforced material to print with, and then by using this mold, they'll actually chemically seal these pieces together, making it one monolithic structure that will be airtight. This has good insulatory properties, and will also make construction easier. Obviously you can tell this is much more simple than this.